Good morning, Redwoods. It's Teacher Jen. Um, since we can't have a morning meeting, and I certainly am missing all of you, I just wanted to send a video your way and say hi. I hope you guys are staying home and staying healthy. Um, a couple of things I wanted to talk to you about. First, I want to make sure that everybody saw the work that you're working on at home. Even though we don't have school in the school building, it's still important that we're doing some learning at home. So um, there's all lots of options. You can play some Dreambox. You can do some Raz Kids. But please tell your parents. You can reach out to me anytime if you have questions, if the directions aren't clear, or if you just want to check in about how it's going. I'd love to hear from you. Um, one tip I have this week that's really helped me get some work done at home is that I've set a place in my house where I do my work. So right now I'm actually not in my bedroom. I'm in an extra room that we have where nobody sleeps. And when I want to get some work done, I kind of separate myself from other people in the house. I come in here. Sometimes I bring a kitty with me and I do my work in here so I can focus. If you haven't picked a place in your house yet, I think it's a really good idea to pick a spot where you're going to do your schoolwork and you can focus that's separate from the place where maybe you play or you hang out with other people. It can be helpful to have a focus spot. I've got a riddle for you this week. Are you ready? What has one head, one foot, and four legs? And if you think you know, you can email or send a video back to me with your best guess. What has one head, one foot, and four legs? And then last, I wanted to share one thing that I'm grateful for. I know we do this a lot in school and with things being so weird right now, it's been extra important for me to think about what I'm grateful for so that I'm focusing on some of the positive things. So this week, one thing I'm grateful for, you're looking at it. I'm grateful for furry friends to hang out with when we're staying home and being safe. Let me know what you're grateful for. You can send a video or shoot me an email, or you can ask your parents to share my uh, cell phone number with you, and you can send it to me that way too, okay? I miss you a lot, Redwoods. Can't wait to see you guys soon. And Kitty says hi.